Technology has become a crucial element in most districts back to school plans, but for students who don't have access, access to or a device that is access to remote learning is tricky. That's why Idaho Business for Education has collected hundreds of computers for local students to use this upcoming school year. It's all part of the Close the Digital Divide event. They collected nearly 1,300 used computers at drop-off locations across the state. Idaho Business for Education also got about $20,000 in cash donations. That money can be used to buy computers or internet devices for students in need. Organizers say the event was successful, all thanks to the help of their volunteers. We had volunteers from all sectors of our community. It was really an Idaho effort. Um, all Idahoans really leaned in, and we had more than 100 volunteers all across the state working on this. Governor Little announced he'll be putting millions of dollars toward funding these digital resources. In a press conference last week, the governor emphasized the importance of getting students back in the classroom, but said with case numbers still high each day, online may be the safest option. Several school districts in the Treasure Valley and across the state have announced their reopening plans, and many of those include remote learning. The governor says he's directing nearly $50 million towards other resources for a better remote learning process and to close that digital divide. Blended learning will be a reality for many Idaho students, and we're equipping schools with computers, connectivity, and other resources to ensure successful remote learning. School will, of course, be different for each district, but each student should be able to access their curriculum from home.